So which of these two forces is stronger? Is it the normal force or the force of gravity? Think about that for a second. Which of these is the stronger force? And some people might be tempted to say that gravity should be stronger because the entire planet is pulling this book down. How could my hand possibly be pushing up with more force than that? But that's incorrect because if this force of gravity was stronger, if I drew it as a longer arrow, then this stronger force would cause this thing to fall. It would sink right through my hand, which would be weird. So it can't be stronger. Well, could the normal force be stronger? Is that the stronger force, me pushing up on the book? Well, that can't be right either because then there would be, here, let me draw this as a short arrow here. If the upward force is stronger than the downward force, the overall force would be in the upward direction, which means this book would start accelerating up and rising into the air. And that doesn't make any sense. So if this book is not accelerating, that means the force in the upward direction should be exactly as strong as the force in the downward direction, which means it should be like this, equal forces, so that they cancel out. And that brings us to my next topic, which is something called net force. And net force, which is shown as F sub net, is a way of saying total force or overall force. So the net force on this book has to be equal to zero because if it's anything but zero, it's going to accelerate. But we know this book was not accelerating.